Welcome back to my channel it's your girl taylor lynn if you haven't already make sure that you head over to my channel that way you can subscribe also hit the little bell if you're feeling inclined to that way whenever i post a video you will get the notification and you won't miss a video if you're new to my channel thank you for coming and clicking on this video if you like what you see like i said head on over hit the subscribe button i'm almost at 100 followers and i'm so excited um my last video really like brought in some followers so I'm hoping to just like keep the momentum going and uploading so that way I can give you guys what you want to see and if you are not new and you've been coming to my channel and watching my videos thank you so much for supporting me I really appreciate it and yes yeah, so let me know down in the comments interact with me let me know what it is that you guys want to see that way I am putting out content that you guys want to watch yeah so today's video is, I know you read the title, I went and I spent some money in Dollar Tree in Walmart. Alright, we're back. Um, my camera died, but I also, um, I think the last clip you've seen, I said I had spent money in um, Family Dollar in Walmart. What? I went and I spent some money in Dollar Tree and Family Dollar. Not a lot of money, you know, because I'm a little broke. But I did go and pick up some things that I wanted to show y'all because, you know, you know, I wanted to do a little haul for you guys. The first, the first place is Dollar Tree. Honestly, when I be going into stores, especially like if I'm just running in really quick for stuff, I kind of forget to bring my reusable bags. So luckily Dollar Tree had me and I didn't even have to pay for this bag because most places are making you pay like 15 cents, 45 cents. And I just feel like if I'm giving you money, well, I gotta pay for the bag. But that's a whole nother conversation. The first really good find that I found in Dollar Tree were these canvases. Now, if you guys are TikTokers like me, there was this girl who was like, y'all, like go to the Dollar Tree and go to the arts and crafts section and you will be amazed at what you can find. Sis, I was amazed at what I found. So these canvases, normally I go to Hobby Lobby and I'll grab my canvases. So let's see, are you gonna zoom? So it just looks like this and it's just like a plane. Literally just a plain canvas. And normally I go to, come on light, come on. Um, normally I go to Hobby Lobby and I get my canvases. And I wanna say like, depending on what's, like this is an eight by 10. This is probably like $5 at Hobby Lobby and I got Okay, that's it. I got five canvases for $5. What? Crazy to me, crazy. So I did get these eight by um, eight by tens. So they're like a good size to do some canvas work. Cause I've been really into like painting and like trying to get better at painting. Like my stuff don't look like nothing right now. <laughs> right now, baby girl. But come back to me in like two years and I'm basically gonna be Picasso, like it's just. Next up, I got these gloves. They're just like um, exfoliating gloves and you put them on, I don't know like if you guys haven't like ever used them before, but you basically just like put it on and then like, I like I guess you could put it on and then take a full blown shower with it, but I like to like take a shower with my regular like body soap and stuff and then I'll go in with my glove and then like an exfoliator um like a sugar scrub your skin your skin will <laughs> thank me like if you have never purchased these before they're really 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 amazing next up because oral hygiene is important I just got um, a toothbrush and it actually comes with like the little scraper like if you have plaque on your teeth which is this thing right here in the corner it's like you know 
the thing that your dentist used and then it has like a little mirror that your dentist also uses so that you can like see in your mouth it comes with a tongue scraper and then it also comes with a toothbrush and I thought for a dollar this is pretty good then I also got these pretty cool scissors I've actually been looking all over the place for these when you cut they actually cut with this type of pattern around it um just because I've been into like scrapbooking like journaling like just really creative stuff lately um this was the only one that they had at my store so I couldn't find ones with other patterns I could only find this one so I'll definitely be going back to check to see if they have some more um patterns but I really like this one because it kind of like reminds me of a cloud back to oral hygiene <laughs> um I just picked up this um, why am I blanking on the name right now? Mouthwash. Um, it's in the scent Fresh Mint. And just something, you know, to rinse your mouth out with. Nothing crazy. And then, I thought this was honestly so cool. I don't know how well they're going to work. <laughs> but I found acrylic paint in, in a three fluid ounce tube, which is pretty good. Um, yeah, I don't know how well it's gonna, like work on the canvas like how good of paint this is it's crafters brand so like I said I don't know how well this is gonna show up on my canvas or anything but I feel like if all else fails I could probably mix it with other colors to get like cool colors and like I can get some use out of these but these are the only two colors that they had so I'll definitely be going back to see if they have like some other some other colors that was everything from Dollar Tree and I just I was like I have to come show you guys because I just really felt like I found really good stuff in Dollar Tree next unexpectedly I went to un unexpectedly I hope I'm saying it right unexpectedly <laughs> it wasn't intentional I went to Family Dollar and I went to go to Family Dollar to look for one thing and I ended up finding stuff that I didn't need. <laughs> I, I bought paper cups. I don't know if you guys want to know that, but I did buy paper cups. They're not in here because they're in our dining room because we're using them right now. I only have a few things from here. So um, I bought this cute little... Isn't it so cute? It's like a mini, it says mini storage, but to me it almost kind of looks like a recycling bin or like a garbage can. So I thought this was so, I thought this was so cute. Oh my gosh, look at this. With the wheels and they actually like spin. I mean, it's kind of a, oh, is the wheel coming out? Wait a damn minute. <laughs> It just clips back into place. I'm a little dramatic. But yeah, I thought this was really cute and it's um, pretty deep. I guess you can kind of fill it with whatever you want. I got it. It was a dollar and I just thought this was so cute. Um, next, I got some erasers and I thought these erasers were so cute. They look like crayons. They look like crayons. Like what? That's so creative. Uh, just some mechanical pencils, electric pencils. No, see, they're called mechanical pencils, but maybe I didn't call them that. My girlfriend was like, no, they're called, but I probably didn't call them mechanical pencils, knowing myself. I got this really cute, oh my God, planner, y'all. Like, this is so cute. Like, it really gives me, like, Victoria's Secret vibes. Um, it's really cute. My girlfriend keeps saying that. It's giving me Victoria's Secret vibes, but it really is though. It's um, it's I think it's I think it's the pink and the white and the like stripes. It's really cute. I like it a lot. And it says, "If you believe it, you can achieve it," which is so true, y'all. If you can believe it, you can achieve it. Um, it has like this folder when you first open it, and I guess this is like if you want to put some stuff in. Is this a folder? Yeah, it's a folder. I mean, ain't nothing gonna be able to get in here it's so tight um but yeah it's a folder and then it says this book belongs to you know basic I mean I don't want to go through all the pages and stuff with you but um it just it's really cute um 
it's like perfect and it has like these little quote pages um, in between each month and it's undated that was the most important thing it's like this and the pages are I really like them a lot it says impossible is for the unwilling what that is so true John Keats come on John mmm that's a quote it just has like some sticker pages in the back I really love that and there's like three pages of these so this is like really really great those were my finds and I was so excited with everything that I found um and yes yeah, so I just wanted to come and do like a mini little Dollar Tree family dollar haul that's it for this video. I hope that you guys really enjoyed it. If you want to see more of these videos, just let me know down in the comments. And yeah, I will see y'all in my next video.